Glasgow European Open, it's a, a World Cup event, European Open level. It's uh, one of the highest levels you can compete at. It's the first level where you can start accumulating Olympic qualification points. So competing there was brilliant. Um, home turf and getting a medal there was, was fantastic. Uh, it kind of gave me a, a real confidence boost and renewal and faith that I'm doing the right things and hopefully spur me on to bigger and better things. I've known for a long time myself what I was capable of. I didn't have such a successful junior career. I'd been putting in a lot of effort and that kind of reflected on Glasgow. Just everything kind of fell into place on the one, on the one day and culminated in a gold medal. I started when I was four um, and that I just kind of just never really stopped. Um, I think I had too much energy as a kid. I tried, uh, tried a lot of different sports. When I kind of got to high school, mum and dad said, you know, you need to choose, choose one thing and it was only really one option. Uh, I would never really had any other interest in anything apart from judo. Balancing everything is really, really tough. Typical day is, you know, up early, you know, about 6am or something in for training, from training straight to uni, taking food with me as I go. It's really hard, it just kind of goes day by day. Uni training, uni training, sleep, working, there's not much time for anything else really. Being part of the Winning Streams programme has basically allowed me to train more um, whilst also continuing my studies. Um, it means I don't have to work as much as I would if I didn't have the support, the financial support from winning students. Um, it's meant I've been able to get more international exposure, so travelling to more places, competing more, um, it's just been a really great complement to my sport, as well, alongside having you know, a possible future career with a good degree as well. Harriet Watt has a sports scholarship programme um, which complements winning students so they give me a lot of academic flexibility so last year I was uh, training out in Japan, I uh, had some exams to do and um, Harriet Watt allowed me to do my exams over in Japan um, they're very flexible with allowing me to miss lectures or tutorials I just see a kind of gradual progression in my career, hopefully make senior British squad this year and progress through more World Cups at the sim similar level as Glasgow hopefully progress through that to Grand Prix Grand Slam and on to Olympics and Commonwealth Games.